That's what I want you to do. What a tough. I gotta be right outside of this one. Let me hit that. So I'm so this is part of footsies is um you want to hit all right so everybody pretty much in street fighter that plays a lot they know how to block so they know how to block high low mix ups they know how to throw tech and all that kind of stuff but one thing that you can't you can't do is block after you've thrown the normal out so one of the things you can do in footsies is 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 kicking or hitting that attack while it's out so that's what i'm doing So I need to, I want to know the range I need to stand at in order so I can I can be effective. You know. Really hard to So So for me, I need to make sure that I'm like outside of Standing heavy kick. Right? I, I need to be about right there. So what I would do in a game, I would do, I would try to like, I would try to kick him once, or get hit by it one time, so it pushed me out. See that time I was too close. So you see I'm like kicking his foot. I'm kicking. So that's that's called footsies, and that's how that's how you that's also called what is the proper term is called whiff punishing. That's what it's called. That's called whiff punishing. He wants to do that all the time. Ryu wants to low medium kick you to death. That's the game. So you want to figure out how to space yourself in a spot where you don't get hit by it. Like I, I'm not getting hit by it right now. I can probably get a little closer, but right there, that's where I want to stand, because he can't hit me with it right there. It looked like he could, but the hitbox is like, you know, what's going to actually hit me is the little, like his little, little hitboxes, and it's like right by like the bottom part of his pants. So I want to stand out in that outside of that range. So that's where I want to be. I want to be like right here. So you see people in, in Street Fighter. Well, you'll see me doing this when I'm playing a match. I'll actually play some matches tonight, a few matches. Um, and you'll see me like walking back and forth, like right here. So what I want to do is I want to make him throw that out. I want to make him want to press that button. And I want to kick it, you know? So my, my goal is to make him throw it so that I can punish him. That is called whip punching. That's where per poker comes in. You know, like I was telling one of my friends, Jared, about that uh, yeah. recently yeah. when we were at the gym. It's like, that's what that's what fighting games are like. And there's like a, a guy that actually does play fighting games. Um, and he said that he uses his, and he used to play professional poker. And he said that um, that was one of the things you had to learn how to do is like read people in poker. So if you know how to read people well, and you know what they want to do, like then Street Fighter or fighting games in general is what you want to you, you can play that professionally so for me I know to play Ryu I need I need to be I need to be right see that like I need to be right outside of my my heavy kick range I need to be about right here so, I want to see if I can heavy, heavy kick it see I can heavy kick it because I'm, I'm outside of range so I want to be about right here, right where I can hit him with mine, so about right there. If I'm outside of that range, that's how I can spatially tell myself that this is where I need to be. If I'm back here, I can't do nothing. I can't do anything back here. But if I'm right here, he, he's in trouble. Like I'm literally kicking his foot and, and I can buffer PX. I can buffer that into my, um, into this. So if I do it fast, like, it shouldn't come out. So I'm doing it, like, pretty fast, so. See? 
So that's called whiff punish. So the conclusion is you want to make sure that you find out whatever you want to find the attack that your opponent uses the most or or at least a, a few of them you want to find a few of them or the ones that you know they use and you want to figure out the range in order to beat it and you need to find the normal that you need to use in order to beat it so that's that's in a nutshell that's what you want to do so that's with punishment